Step 4. Editing the GDL object. Activate the arrow tool and select the door. Keeping the object selected, activate the File, Libraries and Objects, Open Object command. The GDL master window opens. Click on the 2D Symbol button to open the 2D Symbol editing window. The current symbol, which was derived from the 3D model, is not suitable for us since it contains too many line segments but no opening line. Activate the arrow tool and select all lines between the door frames as shown on this picture, and then hit the delete button on your keyboard. All unnecessary lines are cleared from the door. Complete the 2D symbol using the line and the circle tools as shown below. Save your changes. Close the 2D symbol window. Close the GDL master window. Back on the floor plan, check the result of your last changes. Our custom door is now complete, although its capabilities are limited compared to the standard door objects of the ARCHICAD library. Let's just list a few of these missing features. The size and material of door components example given frame, are not parametric. No optional door accessories, example given trim sill, header, shutter, handle, etc. are available. The floor plan symbol is not scale sensitive. The door leaf can't be opened with editable hotspots in 2D and 3D views. In the next part of this interactive training guide chapter, we'll explain how you can create and use custom door panels with the standard ARCHICAD door library objects.